hi everyone welcome back to my channel my name is T and today I have another challenge today we have 2 times 5 equals 10 fruit challenge of course my camera is dying I'll be back all right y'all so I'm back so this challenge is a 2 times 5 equals 10 challenge it's by Prissy P and the PR gang and the epic empire yes so like I said, we're going crazy with these challenges, um, but I love it because it's healthier foods, right? Healthier options. So this week, um, you know, I, I think I'm doing three challenges this week. The five day veggie challenge, go on bananas, and <laughs> two times five equals 10 fruit challenge. All right, y'all, so I have 12 minutes to eat two times five fruits, which means I have to eat two type of fruits and I have five different kinds. Why do I have six on here? I don't know. But two times five equals 10. Okay, that's what we're doing today. So I'm gonna put my timer on. Cause you know I'm hungry, right? You know I'm hungry. I'm always hungry for these challenges. It's the only way to do it. And you know I gotta talk shit. <laughs> Cause that's the only way I'm gonna get through it. It is a lot of food even though it's fruits. But aren't these so beautiful, guys? I wanted... To, okay, so a lot of these fruits are new to me. So, you know, pray for me, y'all. I hope I don't hate them because I'm going to have a very hard time. Um, I've never had the dragon fruit before and I've never had the Korean melon before. But everything else I've had. Without further ado, we're going to do this thing. You know, I got to pump myself up. I got to talk shit because... I don't know how I'm gonna eat <laughs> um, 10 of these. But y'all, I did it to myself, I really did. Cause I didn't have to choose these huge fruits. But let's see what happens. We're gonna attempt to win this challenge. Also, you know I had to go the exotic route. I'm a tropical island girl. I like tropical island things, right? I like beautiful colors, I like tasty, beautiful fruits, so. That's why we have this platter. All right, y'all. <sighs> Deep breath. Okay, let's dig in. I'm gonna start with the kiwi. You know, kiwi is a super food, by the way. It's good for you. Mm-mm. Well, if you never had the yellow ones, try it. Ooh, it's a little sour at the bottom, but it's mostly sweet. What are these called? So these are the Jumbo Sun Gold. Kiwis. Half a kiwi done. I think I'll try these guys. What do you think? I don't know. Maybe I should try the leche. Mm. Mm -mm. I gotta eat another one. That one was kind of bitter. Mm -mm. I'll eat another one, guys. Don't worry. The thing is with leche, sometimes you buy it and it's no good. So those two weren't very good. So I'm gonna. Mhm. Mm if you never had the leche, try it. It's like, it's similar to what Jamaicans call guinep. I'm gonna eat, um, oh, kinda bitter. Okay. So I'm gonna try the dragon fruit, y'all. It's so beautiful, wow. Want a bite? Mm. 
Okay. I don't love it, y'all. I think I should have tried it first. Guys, I'm about to struggle. But that's what I get. Talking about some I'm an exotic. What? Um I think these fruits would be great to put in um I think these would be good to put in smoothies. Especially the dragon fruit is so vibrant. So this is how the Korean melon looks. Oop. I don't really know. Oh. So this tastes like like honeydew. Oop. Yeah, it's just it tastes like a honeydew melon. Okay. It's good. I have um, plums. So y'all, the wreath. Mm. Mm -mm. Yeah, that's sour. Pray for me. <laughs> Y'all, when you do this challenge, don't do what I did. Don't be like tea. Get some regular smuggler fruits because this is beautiful ain't it you would think oh my god it's so delicious it sure did stay in my dress so it don't taste bad and I can taste where it even wants to be sweet it's beautiful I can taste where it wants to be sweet. It has like a a faint sweet taste. The taste is definitely not as vibrant as it looks. That's one thing I can say about it. It's not bad. And I think the reason why it also isn't as strong. The kiwi was very, very strong and powerful in um, flavor. It was like sweet, sour, but just strong flavors. I can eat this. This is subtle. I can't explain what it tastes like. So I don't hate it. I actually can eat this again. If you're a fan of honeydew, you would like that. Mm. Only thing is, um, the Korean melon is not as sweet as honeydew. But it's good. I can't knock it. No. I thought I was going to come in here and boss this challenge. You know. But you win some, you lose some, right? You can't win all of the challenges. Yeah, you can't win them all, right? I know I'm probably supposed to peel this. 
maybe it will make it easier for me mm -hmm. it definitely tastes like a honeydew so I'm gonna peel it which also make this stuff take so much time I know a lot of people are gonna do a bunch of different challenges I mean different fruits y'all think I'm still in the game mm. yeah definitely I'm getting honeydew so when I asked someone today what it's what this would taste like they told me that it's a cross between an apple and a pear I can see that but I think it just really tastes like a honeydew and a cantaloupe put together in my opinion that's what it tastes like if you've ever had Korean melon before let me know what you guys think this tastes like it's a big knife y'all know that I was in the Korean store spending all my monies like I do every week so I have 12 minutes 12 minutes to complete this let's see how I'm doing nine minutes oh, man I guess I'm not winning mm-hmm the more you eat this, the better. Mm -hmm. The texture is like definitely like a pear. Okay. Honeydew cantaloupe. It tastes more like a cantaloupe than a honeydew. I guess I'll just keep eating my kiwi the kiwi is um, my favorite thing on here and remember guys that the kiwi is a super fruit mm. this tastes like a mango and a banana put together the sun gold kiwi it's really good But as you get to the bottom, it gets a little sour. But for the most part, it's sweet and juicy. So as y'all can tell, I'm not winning this. Not at all. But it was worth a try. So I'm going to use my opportunity to, you know, tell y'all what it tastes like. So definitely tastes like a, a um it's juicy like a mango but it kind of tastes like a, a banana as well it doesn't have the creaminess of the banana but i'm getting hints of banana hints of banana and um mango Mm -hmm. mm. It's a juicy, y'all. It's good. I don't know why I'm showing y'all like I'm winning. The race is over <laughs> for me. I lost. Um. We see how much time I have left. 
Y'all think I put a dent in it? <laughs> I had fun. So you guys know what bananas taste like. These were really sour after the kiwi. So even though I love plums, I just could not. My leches were bitter today. So when you get these guys, make sure it's fresh. I don't know if they're not fresh. I don't know what the deal is, but they definitely taste kind of bitter. Which is so disappointing because I love leches. Yeah. They definitely have a hint of sourness going on. So. Oh, but that one's good. Just, um, you know. It's like squirted on me. Yeah, y'all. So. For fruits like leche, kind of like ginup, ginup, it, it'd be a hit, hit or miss sometimes. Where it's not always what you want it to taste like. Like I said, these are kind of bitter. So. I would recommend you doing the sun gold kiwi even trying the Korean melon if you're big and robust flavors for fruits don't try the dragon fruit it's not very flavorful I would recommend the dragon fruit for smoothies um y'all know what apples taste like you know what plums taste like leches are good but just make sure it's fresh or like in season I don't I can't explain these but they're not very sweet and they're more bitter than I remember but also it's probably because I had the kiwi yeah I'm not feeling the leches guys but I usually love them so I hope you enjoyed this video and my attempt to bring some ex exotic fruits to my channel also, thank you again, PR Gang, Epic Empire, Percy P, for doing this these challenges because we really, really, like I said, the mukbang community really appreciates it. It puts us on the map. Thank you guys for, you know, trying to bring us up as you go. So, as I always say, your time is your most valuable currency and you chose to spend it with me. Thank you guys so, so, so much. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And share my video with everyone. Bye. Girl, you're so wet like summer.